spring, clap once. If you like candy, clap twice. If you like all kinds of candy. But you know what's cool? Because I looked over in the side where all the dirt was and we piled up. And I saw something very, very special. Is it what? Have you guys ever seen a cat when you were on the bus all by herself? No. no, right? Hi, I'm Carmen Oliver. I'm a children's author of fiction and nonfiction books. I also run a small boutique agency, a booking agency, that brings authors and illustrators into schools and libraries, workshops, keynotes and conferences around the United States and around the world. Um, I was offered this amazing opportunity to come to Highlights Foundation and be a part of a faculty that was putting together Crafting Successful Author Visits. I have met some amazing um, authors and illustrators on this journey. I've seen them grow from the beginning of the course that lasts a week long, and they come in with an idea, a spark for a program, based on their book or their, their soon-to-be-released book. Like, we and see people that have a first book coming out that you know, maybe have only done a couple of bookstore events or maybe a couple of uh, small classroom settings. Um, we encourage them um, and support them and help them grow their skills so that you know, they feel confident to go into a large setting, mm -hmm. you know, an audience of 300, 400, 500 people. And we help them build a program where from the gr ground up, you know, they, and, and it's all them. You know, it's, it's them showing them, helping them along, guiding them with a great opening, a hook, engaging mm -hmm. their audience, developing their pro program, but it's using their material. It's using what they have to say and what's important to them so that they can connect with their audience. When I first came to the Highlights Workshop, I was terrified of the idea of getting up in front of people and talking. I discovered that being nervous is a good thing. It helps you be better at presenting. So I've learned to embrace my nervousness and use it to push myself to get better. And I feel a lot more confident after doing my first school visit today with all of the advice and tips that I've learned from this week. And I feel extremely ready to go out there into the world and do some more school visits.